Congratulations on the award, Arvind. Yeah. Thank you very much. And what we're trying to do with this film and, and this... And, well, and, and yeah, I guess you've achieved it, obviously, but you know, what were you actually... I think, uh, well, first and foremost, we were trying to raise awareness mm -hmm. for the issue for domestic violence mm -hmm. and trying to make sure that um, you know, people, women who find themselves in situations like that, know that there potentially is a way out to show them that there are other people going through the same situation and are um, making efforts, uh, whether that's by in engaging with the justice system or by going to support groups or calling helplines. Um, we just wanted to make sure that people knew that you know, there are things that you can do and, and, and to make sure that they knew what the, warnings, that what the warning signs were so that early on, if you are in a relationship that is starting to feel not right, mm -hmm. you actually can, uh, can decide whether it is or isn't. And if it isn't, that you make sure you get the hell out of there. In, in, I mean, in such difficult circumstances and subject matter, how did you find your role as a director and, and, and the process of actually trying to tell this story in a way that's respectful to the subject matter and your, and your cast? Mm. Well, I think first and foremost, it's actually allowing people to speak mm -hmm. and giving them a platform to tell their own stories. Because m most people you know, are very good storytellers anyhow. They don't really need a lot of direction. They just need to be asked the right questions. Mm -hmm. So for me, that was working together with Sarah, with the presenter, with Sarah Ferguson, in establishing an environment in which people felt comfortable to do that. And uh, you know, knowing that we were taking what they were saying serious, um, but also allowing them to tell their stories. I think too often we, in our efforts to protect people, mm -hmm. we don't let them say things that are controversial or we don't let them you know, go all the way. We wanted to make sure that they actually said what was on, on their minds and, um, and, and to do it with, you know, with, with as many safety, um, uh, my apologies, sorry, to do that with as many uh, uh, safety valves as possible. Mm -hmm. And, and so I guess finally, what was the biggest lesson you learned on this project and that you're going to take with you into further things? Well, subject wise, mm -hmm. um, the biggest lesson that we learned is that, you know, domestic violence is not about violence. It's about control. Mm -hmm. It's about one person wanting to make sure that they control every aspect of another person's life. The violence often comes later or is part of that. Um, and uh, in terms of, of future projects, I just think that, uh, um, you know, it, it, it just made me realize that while these projects are hard, um, uh, the outcome, uh, you know, which was, was quite overwhelming. We saw enormous uh, rise in the numbers of people who sought advice and sought uh, calling helplines and were talking to refugees in the, uh, afterwards. And I think it just made us realize that, you know, uh, subjects are tougher. We have to do them and stick to stick with it. So, yeah. Well, yeah. We've done a fantastic job. Congratulations. And yeah, hopefully you see you here again. Thank you very much. Have a good evening. Take care. Thanks. Thanks a lot.